welcome back. Thanks a lot for staying with us. Our rolling coverage here on CNN News 18 continues. We're under six hours for that anticipated successful landing of Chandrayaan 3 on the South Pole as far as the moon is concerned. A lot of hard work has gone in, a lot of press still continue to ensure that it is a success this time around. Just take a look at some of the visuals that are coming in from across the country. These are visuals that are coming in from Jammu where various pujas, parts, havans continue to take place. As I pointed out, there are billion hearts that are praying and beating for the success as far as Chandrayaan 3 is concerned. And as I pointed out, this becomes significant on multiple levels because this was heartbreaking last time around when the last few minutes there was a crash landing as far as the lander is concerned. But this time around, our scientists are confident that a lot of work has gone in. They've understood the concern areas and those areas, in fact, have been addressed. But despite all of that, if you heard the commentary that came from the ISRO chairman, he said what we will be monitoring are what he called the 15 minutes of terror. And this is the final descent before the lander actually touches the surface. And this is going to be the South Pole of the Moon. So let's talk to you about why this is being called as such a terrifying phase, 15 minutes of terror, because this is where the lander moves towards the Moon. And at this point of time, the speed is 6,000 kilometers per hour. Just to give you better context, this is where things went down last time around the velocity couldn't be contained according to what the numbers were on the book and this is what the scientists hope to achieve this time around this is where the isro in fact will be giving a direct command as far as our lander vikram is concerned all four engines of the lander at this point of time just in the last 15 minutes of their descent will in fact be used and if that is a success then history in fact will be created as I pointed out, let's talk about the speed once again. The speed, in fact, will be reduced to two meters to a second. But what is also going to be crucial is the position of the lander when it finally touches the surface of the moon. The lander has to be made vertical and this is called the final braking phase. This is where it's going to be either make or break as far as the work of ISRO is concerned. And that is why the ISRO chairman time and again has said that this is 15 minutes of terror. So somewhere around 5.45 p.m. Indian Standard Time, this time around, that final descent will begin. And post 6 p.m., we are hoping for that successful landing of Chandrayaan 3. 